Hi there, this is Graham. Um, I just want to give you a quick uh, walkthrough of the unit. And uh, so I'm just going to click here on, um, this is it, we're, we're in Blackboard already, as you can see here, here's my cursor. Um, so this is the learning communicating online. I'm in the uh, tutor view um, for tutors, so this might look a little bit different to yours. I can click here on student view actually, and um, it might uh, look more like what you have. So uh, I would just um, go through, if this is my first time in, I would just go through all of these items on the left hand side. So we'll click on home page. Uh, there, this is what's here, then getting started. Okay, there's a video here, um, how to use Blackboard. Seven minutes, wow, seven minutes. That's a big chunk out of my day. But I would watch that video. And then about this unit, uh, this, this is an important page. Uh, so I would read this carefully. I might even print this off and um, highlight the important areas here. Um, these are all important areas. Now these learning outcomes are interesting because this is what we'll, we'll probably be marking you on. Um, whoops, yeah, don't worry about that. That happens every time I use Captivate to make a screen video, so don't worry about that color change. Um, generic skills that you'll learn along the way. Um, there's no e-text for this unit, but there are readings uh, every week. Here are some information about unit improvements. Um, assessment, there's more information on assessment under the assessment tab, minimum requirements to pass, a little bit about the team assessment, there's just one team assessment in this unit. Um, referencing, this is very important, uh, we'll come back to referencing. Yeah, so that tab about the unit is one of the most important tabs and you'll probably come back to that several times during the course of the unit. Um, the schedule, you might like to print this out again. We start on week one, which was the 6th of July, and uh, we go through for six weeks before there's a break, and then there's a week break. We come back for another six weeks from the 24th of August until Friday, 2nd of October. For anyone taking notes, that's my birthday. Woohoo! Okay, quickly moving forward. Um, the toolbox, we've come out of Blackboard to go to the toolbox. You might like to go through these. There are tools here that will help you with your studies. Close that. Announcements. Um, the, this is the email that Tanya sent you the other day, the welcome email, but you can find that here in announcements if, it's not, if you're not checking your email, but you should be checking your student email every day really, uh, meet your ELAs. So there's quite a number of ELAs um, teaching this unit and I am one of them. I have groups 42 to 46. So if you're watching this, you are highly likely in one of these five groups. Each group has about um, 35 students to start with, but due to natural attrition, um, the groups usually end up being at around 20 to 25 students per group. Um, students uh, pull out for a number of different reasons. Um, contact us, that again takes you out of the unit, uh, out of Blackboard to the Swinburne page and you can fill out this form. Um, the number for support is here and also you can um, contact support via this email address help at swinburneonline.com. Okay, and back to, here are the learning materials. Okay, I'm going to spend a whole video on learning materials, so I'm not going to look at that right now. Uh, collaborate links is where you will come. We do online video conferencing before each assessment, where you can ask questions in real time about the assessments. And uh, if you click on these links, it'll have information there about how to join the online video conference. Learning groups, your learning group may be here. Uh, assessments, this is another important, really important tab. So the three important tabs for me um, as a student would be about this unit, the schedule, and assessments. So here are the three, uh, here are the um, five assessments for this unit. Um, the word limit, you need to come in at either 10% above or below the word limit. So for example, for a thousand word essay, 
Um, the minimum you can submit without losing marks is 900 words, and 1,100 words is the maximum. Um, you can see here assessment 2A is a team task with a weighting of 30%, and it's due on Monday 14th of September, which interestingly is my partner's birthday. Wow, okay, it's all in the family. Um, and then you can click on these links which will give you information or take you rather to the assessment um, to, where you can submit. You can see here this is for assessment 1A um, which is due in week 3. Uh, more about assessments later and just about assessment support. Um, your tutor and smart thinking are available to you to assist you um, with your submission and with your assessments. Uh, my progress, this will be updated as you go through your time at Swinburne Online with your grades. And that's all I wanted to show you today, how to um, go through this um, side menu. Again, I'd like to highlight that about this unit is very important. The schedule and assessments vital information. All right, we'll catch you on the next one, the next video, which will be about learning materials. See you then.